Hello and welcome to Grilling with Johanna at Feel Good See You. Today we're going to be learning how to make our March specialty sandwich of the month. The apple, brie, and cinnamon sandwich, also known as our ABC sandwich. So first you're going to need two slices of bread, any, any kind. Once we have our bread, we'll want to take the cheese and spread it all over the bread. It's gonna be a little bit gooey. So instead of actually like just kind of putting slices on, it's gonna be more of a spread. But that's okay, because it'll still taste cheesy and delicious. And don't worry about cutting off the wax, because you can actually eat that too. Um, it adds a little bit of texture and kind of like a nutty flavor-ish, but it's really, really good. Oh, and make sure you get enough cheese all over the bread because otherwise you're not going to really taste it. And what's the point of grilled cheese if you can't taste the grilled cheese? Right? Right. Get a little bit more cheese. Maybe a little bit more. And now we're ready. Almost for the cinnamon. So we have our cinnamon here. We open it and sprinkle it all over the cheese. Okay, now we're done with that. We're on to our final step, the apple. So what I'd like to do with the apple is cut off a big chunk on the side like so, or not like so. <laughs> oh, it helps when you have a really sharp knife, which I wish I did. Almost there. Okay. All right, so we have our apple, and it's a pretty big chunk. I like to cut into smaller slices after I cut off a big chunk because then it's easier to place onto the sandwich and it's also not gigantic. So you have like a couple of thinner slices that you can lay out just like so. I don't know if you can see. Like so. Oh, and also make sure you wash the apple first. Just to make sure there aren't any pesticides and gross stuff on there. And last piece here. All right, and we have our apple. So now we can do as we do with all sandwiches. We place the two pieces of bread together and pop it into the grill, which you can see back there, hopefully. All right, so we'll let that grill for a little bit. But in the meantime, I'll tell you some cheesy jokes. <laughs> All right, so two antennas met on a roof, fell in love, and got married. The ceremony wasn't much, but the reception was excellent. <laughs> Get it? Reception. Right, next one. A jumper cable walks into a bar. The bartender says, I'll serve you, but don't start anything. Which kind of defeats the point of a jumper cable, don't you think? <laughs> the next one. Two cannibals are eating a clown. Ew. One says to the other, does this taste funny to you? <laughs> I don't know, but I think a clown would taste pretty funny. My next favorite, why was Cinderella so terrible at football? Because she had a pumpkin for a coach. Duh. I think Cinderella should probably watch the Red Titans to pick up some tips. And the last, but not least, two fish swim into a concrete wall. The one turns to the other, and says, damn, damn, without an end though, <laughs> get it? All right, so <laughs> now that we're done with the jokes, hopefully your sandwich is done too. Let's walk over here and check. Oh, I hear some sizzling. All right, and I think your sandwich is good to go. So we'll take it out of the grill carefully. And 
ta-da! You have your apple green cinnamony goodness. So the last step, which is my personal favorite, cut it in half. And enjoy!